the neon nail thing. <laughs> Yo, she looks so good in this video. Holy cow. Okay, okay. The sex appeal is real. Yo, the set fire part. Oh. <laughs> oh, 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 that was clean. Join right, Team Yarabu and Tony. Yeah, good morning, everyone. It's Tony. Today marks the solo outing, the first solo outing for Mamamoo Solar. So, Solar being the main vocalist of Mamamoo, she is out now with her first solo titled Spit It Out. Solar actually has a YouTube channel. If you want to go check it out, it's called Solar Shido, which is kind of a take, a playful take on Do Re Mi Fo Fa So La Si Do. Which I find quite cute. Even her opening is a take is like showing that she's actually very good at it. She kind of gives an in depth review, like a view into K Idol life, a little bit of like background on the other companies and stuff like that. I find it very interesting content and it's quite fun to watch. This is her first solo outing, as I mentioned, as a solo artist, and the title is Spit It Out. This actually garnered quite a bit of attention, um, not just because of who she is, but also because of the fact that in one of the scenes and one of the teaser images, you do see her bald because you're like, whoa. <laughs> Is that, did she cut her hair? But obviously not. She put like a wig cap on and it's really good VFX. Like, I mean, if she did cut her hair, that's like all the more commitment to her, but I don't think her company would let her to do that because she does have to do other things also. I'm really excited about this. Let's get into it. Jimmy, ready? She, jump. I'm gonna start the music video right now. Oh, the neon nail. Oh, this is like a super sultry vibe. Oh, that was cool. That was sick. I like hand. Oh, we're doing a cat moment. Interesting. This is kind of like the dance break in the beginning. So our voice is so nice. It's like kind of like hazy. There's no way they forced her to cut this hair. This hair is so nice. This song is so nice. <laughs> oh, the way she did that kind of had like a vibe of a uh, what it uh, Billy Eilish almost like bad guy. It's cool. Yo, she looks so good in this video. Holy cow! Uh, Top Gun looks like uh, Chung has snapping videos. Yo, this is such a good song. Oh, the neon outfit. Oh, okay. Okay. Yo, this is such a cool video. The song is really nice. Like, so that voice is so unique that it's like... That's so... <laughs> the fire, fire part, like, really get... Oh, she's like... I didn't notice she's wearing leather pants. Okay! Okay! The sex appeal is real. Yo, but she looks so good in this video, holy cow. Oh. Oh. Oh, the che the beat change up is insane. Yo, it actually sounds like I'm watching a movie. Like, this is like the movie soundtrack right now. That's insane. Oh, here it is. Yeah, there's no way she cut her hair. It's like a... Yo, the set fire part. Oh! Okay, yo, there's no way she cut her hair. Yo, they did a really good, a good job with the, the bald cap on this. 
Oh, 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 Yo, stop staring at me. Please stop. Yo. Oh, that was so good. She looks so good in this. Oh, that's. Why is she just staring at my soul? Oh my god. That was, that's a, that's an absolutely insane music video, guys. The opening had me already hooked just from the, like, pure appeal from it. They did, like, a little bit, like, of a tutting, almost, introduction. I guess that was, like, their dance break. It set up the scene so well. It just brings you in. You have Solar's, like, super sultry voice, like, kind of, like, hazy, almost. And it's so nice. And when she opens up with that, and it's kind of, like, almost, like, a singing rap. And I, I love it when singers kind of, like, try to do something a bit different because she is known for vocals but she's kind of like reaching out a bit in this song and doing a bit more of like um messing around with a bit of like her vocal styling she still has a lot of fun in this video yo she looks super good in this video oh my god they did an amazing job with the videography and just like the outfits in general from from like the uh, le leather outfit to the like kind of like chunga snapping vibe outfit to her dress with the pink gloves to her like more like workout outfit yo they nailed all of the outfits the green dress was interesting maybe it's just because i'm not a huge fan of it but it was it was it was interesting too i think in general the song is going to be a huge hit it takes parts from like i would say maybe more like hispanic like south american vibes because the part of the song sounds kind of like like not brazilian but hispanic almost as like that type of like vibe that i'm getting other portions of the song kind of take a bit more of like an edm more like a poppy vibe i think interesting how they managed to meld that in the song itself it kind of has almost like four different sections you have like one section that sounds very much like with that heavy drums it kind of sounds like you're in a movie and this is like the soundtrack to the movie and then some other parts like near the end it's kind of like you like a big party anthem kind of like that's maybe where i'm getting the hispanic vibe it sounds kind of like you would see maybe like in a fast and the furious near the ending the beginning you have like an interesting opening which is very like maybe middle eastern-esque with the dance like I, I would say dance break but it's more like the hand tutting break and then you also have like opening with solar just doing like her more of like hazy voice i think all of these different i would say sections of the song melt very well together because of the chorus the chorus kind of has incorporations of everything together you have like the haziness when she does like set fire which i absolutely love that's my favorite part so far but then also you have like the beat in the background is very like Middle Eastern Hispanic and then just how she's singing it very associative with that style she did a really good job and this is as her first debut it's a really good song the aesthetics lend itself really well to this song I'm still not sure entirely why she has bald hair in certain saying I think the entire video all of the high production great aesthetics they absolutely killed it hopefully the other members of the group get to do more solos, but like I, from what I know, Solar is probably the only one I think, apart from Wien, who hasn't done a solo. It's good that she finally got a chance to do one. Hopefully, she comes out with a full album or at least like an EP, kind of like Moonbyeol. But we'll see about that, guys. Thank you for watching. Kapsamida. Hope you enjoyed. And until next time, Annyeonghaseyo. Goodbye.